been brought to our attention, you might have a new criminal conviction. He's seen hundreds of cases. These were supposed to be no different. It was a normal, uh, I think uh, one was in on the first appearance on a new charge and the other one was in on a for failure to appear, so we were setting conditions of release. But Apparently that release couldn't come soon enough for Cody Howard and Tanner Jacobson. We were sitting there on the benches together and He's like, he's like, I'm going to run. Handcuffed and dressed in full jail garb, they took off. First Cody, then Tanner. I said, what am I doing? What did I just do? I got to go with it now. There's nothing. I can't stop right here. There's nothing I could do now. I'm, I'm screwed. Witnessing something he'd never seen before, the judge made a split decision. It was just a reaction. I mean, it was just my immediate thought was, you know, got to get these guys. Bolting out of the courtroom, he gave chase not knowing if he'd catch up. I just wanted to at least follow them, find out where they went so they could be apprehended. Flying down three flights of stairs, Tanner made his exit first. I only get like four blocks and then I stopped. Like I just stopped on my own. I'm like, what am I doing right now? Back in the stairwell, Cody wasn't as lucky. The judge had caught up. Give him a little shove to slow him down and then just grab him and we kind of fall out the door and uh, hold him until law enforcement got there. Why did they run? Well, that was my question. It was just a split second like decision. I don't even know why I did it. Like I would be out of here if I wouldn't have ran. I didn't try to escape to get out. I tried to escape to get well and I tried to do what I could, you know, do what I could do to get my drug addiction. It's a split second decision made by a judge after a poor decision made by two inmates. They made things a lot worse. It's never a good idea to run. The two now face new charges of second degree escape. That's a felony. They were in that courtroom only on misdemeanors. Back to you. I don't know what. what Scratching our heads. Yeah. So fascinating to hear from those two guys yeah. of why they decided to run. I'm sure they're young, wishing they had. Young hadn't. guys too. The one guy, he summed it up perfectly. He said, if, if I wouldn't have done it, I wouldn't be here right now. Yeah, <laughs> I'd be home. at himself. What a judge. A superhero He'd be out. judge. Or, or close to being out. Yeah. Great job getting the interview with those inmates too, man. That made it. That yeah, was interesting. Thanks, Devin.